Chris, this peach is kind of dry. <laughs> yeah, it's about three days old. Three days. It's extremely cold outside today and very snowy. Sorry. What's up crew? What's up machine freaks? I hope you guys are enjoying your day. Today I think I'm what would you call this? Am I with a rescue? Yeah, we're, we're, we're yeah. in a recovery. Yes. A recovery? Yeah, we're on okay, a recovery. Okay, so we're currently on a recovery mission. We need to go replace a battery. Yes. I think today I was persuaded to volunteer. So that's what we're doing. So let me try to explain myself better. Basically, Chris owns a shop. Luke and I have decided to, well, I guess help Chris out or get in his way, whatever one comes first. Chris, Chris, you've been in one of my videos. Well, a lot of my older videos, but uh, the, the one the one where he changes out the Duramax tires, this is the guy. Say hi, Chris. What's up? And then, Luke, I don't think you've ever been in a video, nope. but I went to high school with these guys. They're rascals. He does have a pit bike at a shop. Maybe we can. Chris, we're gonna have some fun with that pit bike. Maybe in the midnight hours. In the midnight hours? Midnight hours. That's when stuff gets crazy. Bada bing. So the battery swap out wasn't too exciting, but now we're gonna. Well, Luke is looking at his truck. He's got a Tacoma. This is 2004, right? Yeah. So he's putting it on the lift right now. I'm gonna do some oil and then put some straps on my tank gas tank. I think he currently has ratchet straps. Yep. Now Luke said for this video he's gonna let his truck fall off. You can make it happen can't you? Yeah, just gonna, just put I mean, this one off a it. little bit off. This is a nice lift. I need one of these. My garage isn't big enough though. One day. You know what you're doing? No. <laughs> Luke, it's looking good. All right, so Luke's doing an oil change. Air filter, fire bolts. Fire bolts? Fire bolts? Yeah, spark plugs. <laughs> spark plugs. <laughs> I've never heard him called that before. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Sliding. Uh -oh. Are you sliding? Yeah, I was. <laughs> <laughs> snowy, snowy, snowy in New York. Luke cleaned out the whole parts store. Yeah, baby. <laughs> That thing is new, that thing's like mint. What are we gonna do, Mr. Evil Knievel? Jump off the roof. Backflip in the and, snow. and everything. Double, Just, triple backflip, 360. We had to fix the clutch handle for now. It's broken. He doesn't have an aluminum welder. So we just electrical taped it, but it's working. It works really good. Give it a little wiggle. Where's your, what, that was it? Oh. I like your thinking. Can't lose the socket then. I want to see how your tool works here. There you go. Problem solved. <laughs> Are the parts still hot? A little bit. He touched it with his thumb and it started sizzling. He didn't move his thumb. <laughs> it's been a couple hours and this truck is still leaking. Like that's how much snow and ice like gets in under a vehicle when it snows here in New York. It gets crazy. Chris welded up the first mount because the bolt actually broke off into the frame. This one back here, he's actually got the bolt already out. Now we're just gonna replace one strap at a time and then he'll be golden. You'll have your fire bolts and a gas tank. Look at that. Luke, I think the best news about replacing this is you can reuse these straps now in a useful manner. Bust out the PV blaster. Hey, is the D-Max next? That's all I got. Chris, you have quite a collection here. You don't even have to go to the hardware shop there, no. Luke. You just come here and bam, right there. Nuts and bolts for days. Lucas is now our cameraman, and I am Evil Knievel, I guess. We're going to the park store. Luke and Chris are going in the truck, but I'm taking this. Figure that one out. 
Do you want me to go first? Go ahead. I don't have any back brakes. We made it. Oh God. This oh my goodness. Hard. You can't even see anything. I made it to the part store. Thanks, Chris. Why don't freaking turn it off? Well, oh my goodness. <laughs> so after Chris was bragging about his assortment of junk, we still have to go and buy stuff. What are we, what are we buying here? And it's that's at two and an eighth, right? Two and a quarter. <laughs> I was trying to screw him up. <laughs> we got Jake the toilet snake. Did you see what I drove here? No. Oh, you gotta see my ride, dude. I got a new bike. Yeah? Yeah. Jake, have you ever met these guys before? Of course. Have you? <laughs> They're famous. These guys haven't. Chris says tomorrow we're bringing in the D-Max full throttle. Through my wall? <laughs> <laughs> no, on the lift, buddy. Oh. We're just gonna slap it up on there. Right. Jake said he crashed today. Cause you didn't even you didn't even tell me what happened. What happened? I crashed today. What with what? A four wheeler? A dirt bike? Yep. Was Kyle on the back? No. Oh. <laughs> I ran right into the tree. My throttle got stuck wide open. I kinda started back up because the throttle cable got stuck. It's wide open. So, so Kyle pulled me home. Went back, let everything thaw out, started back up, and it was fine. Ice got on the throttle cable and it just wasn't working. Here's my new rig, boys. Brand new. That's cool. It's pretty cool, huh? 110 cc. I don't know what it is. It doesn't have any brakes, though. You're going to get a shot this time? I did get a shot. I Chris, you want to drive it home? I don't care. Just remember, there's no back brakes, buddy. Oh. So you can't be you can't be giving her up the hill because then there's a road up there. Whoa! I drove it here. Chris, Chris is driving it back. He's already flying. What did he just do? Wow. Got to start hanging out with these guys more often. They're pretty fun. How was it? Decent. Did you spin it out? Yeah, a couple <laughs> times. Dude, I'll that Your truck's going to have to wait there, Lucas. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty squirrely. Dude. Wow, you even got a second junk drawer? Still can't find the right bolt. <laughs> She's finally done. Are you gonna take me for a spin? Hell yeah. Check out the new fire bolt, new gas tank straps. Couldn't get the air filter though today. You oh, wiped man. you wiped the part store right out. They didn't even have an air filter for you even. Hi. Spark plugs work. <laughs> now I know you got plenty of horsepower right now, so don't be uh, flipping it over. <laughs> Dude, we're already stuck. I'm not stuck. <laughs> well, we had to back off of it. Taco don't get stuck. You're gonna get up it? I have four parfaits and a tap water, please. Thank you. I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with Chris, Luke, and I. We had a lot of fun. We got Lucas's truck all done. Celebrated with a little bit of dessert. I figured we could end this 3D Machines production with some fan mail. Can you guys see this? It's mechanics gloves. Dear 3D Machines, I am Dylan D. I am 14 years old and I'm going to school for welding. I know you need some gloves. A lot of you guys know I love gloves, and that's why a lot of you guys have sent them. But that's why Dylan D sends them. He also says, stay fly. Thanks, Dylan. Brap Life 3D Machines. Thank you. These are cool. Hi, Dalton. My name is Matthew. Thanks, Matthew. I'm 13 years old. My dad and I thought of purchasing these for you. Thanks, Matt and Matt's dad. We hope you enjoy them. We think for 500,000 subscribers you should buy a Kawasaki 450. By the way, this is for your Froggy Fresh Duramax. Can you put these on camera? I sure can. And I'm assuming that this is a picture of Matthew. Thanks you guys, I appreciate it. I will put them on the Duramax. It's extremely cold out right now. You guys saw the video. Very cold, but we'll get to it. Last one and then I'll get out of your hair for the day. You guys can go outside and play if you're down south, if you're up north. Maybe you could jump on a snowmobile today. I don't think our trails are open. Thank you, Daniel Gonzalez. Sounds about right. That's all we got time for. I hope you guys enjoyed this 3D Machines production. Enjoy your day. 3D Machines out.